Hello, interwoobs. This is Heath Vlog, start date 1401212. What of it? Okay, I am on my way to an audition for the role of an SOC neighbor. It's Project Realtor. I don't know. I'll tell you what the project is. It's, it's all secrets. They're all secrets. Um, um, I need to like this is going on I think I started these in November 2011 it's now January 2014 and I still say um yeah and whatever so but how are you enjoying the music that I'm attaching to these uh, somebody's coming somebody's coming I'm getting very bright let me back up here okay now I, I can't see I can't look at it so this is my uh my casual neighbor look. I'm wearing uh, my stretchy jeans from Costco. I'm not really looking for anything from Costco like free jeans because it's 16 bucks. I mean, if they were 116 bucks, it'd be like, yeah, Costco, I love it, Costco. Hook me up, Costco, but it means 16 bucks. I don't smoke. I barely go out and drink. So I'm saving. Like cigarettes are what, 10 bucks a pack in Canada now? Like, come on. Two packs of cigarettes, I can get a pair of jeans. I don't smoke, so whatever. Okay, I have my change. To pay for parking. Oh. Okay, I'll let you know how it goes when I get out. I'm out. That there, and by there I mean the audition I was just at, was a recall or a callback for Project Financial. <gasps> I said, um, I know what I want to say. I didn't recognize anybody else from the audition before. There was a young kid by young kid, I'm, I mean like early 20s. So I don't know if we're there. For, I'm doing this, by the way. I can't see because I'm so tight on my face. I do not know if we're there for the same part because we're two totally different body types, face types. There is an, an actor named Rich. Mitch! Oh my god! <laughs> Mitch. There's an actor named Mitch that I worked with on a BASF. It was kind of a commercial. It was like a secret commercial we are filming, but it was a print ad for BASF and their profitability. He was one of the sponge sponge towel guys. I think it was one where there's three of them in the closet and they burst out. I see him a lot at auditions. He's uh, He has red hair thinning on top, uh, a big, like a, a gut, but that's it, that's the extent of his fatness, he just has a gut, he's not a fat guy or, at all, uh, and I think he has glasses too, and then there's me, and so he's probably about five, I'm guessing five, seven, and I'm horrible, I, I would suck at those guess your weight, guess your height games, or they, it's a birthday and your weight, whatever it is, who cares, I'm telling a story here, so, uh, that again. If I could punch myself in the face and really make it hurt, wow, it's glowing. It's a glowing fist. It's a lot of. It's a part Irish in me, I think. It's coming out. Reflect the sun. Yeah, we go. We've been going out for the same part, so. We, we laugh when we see each other, we're like, they don't know what they want. So, so I guess they don't know what they want. Or unless our agents are just sending us out because they don't know what these people want. Maybe they're looking for Mitch or maybe they're looking for me. But our agents just don't know that. that that's enough, right? Two minutes and 50 seconds. Okay. So wherever this was going, that was a recall for Project Financial. That's what I wanted to tell you. Dang it. Now this is going to be like a seven minute thing. I went in. They're like... You have no lines. They just they just want 
they want me to ask you a couple questions. So I went in, they said, you know, Slate, and then we'll ask you questions. So I said, hi, my name is Heath. He's like, big smile. And I said, oh, hi, my name is Heath Hudson. I bit my tongue. So I'm like, oh, I bit my tongue. And they kind of chuckled at that. So they asked me, how did you get into acting? I said, years ago, I was in two really bad zombie movies. And I just got bit by the acting bug. Like, did you get bit by a zombie? I'm like, no, I refuse to get bit by a zombie or killed in these things. And I, I said I would, I would push people down and, and run because I refuse to, I refuse to die by zombie. So then they, uh, so, so then I was, then I kind of focused a bit and I said uh, I started Google. I was at a job that I hated, um, and I was just gaining weight and I'm like, I'm totally gonna. Google agencies. So I start Googling agencies and I'm calling them and the agency I'm with is the first one that didn't ask for money up front and, they, and that got a laugh because you know that's the that's the big thing like a lot of agencies that you know they want money up front. Not legitimate ones, the sketchy ones. Always if you're looking for an agency, first call Fulcher Agency in Toronto on Jarvis Street. Please, they're awesome. Um, if they ask for money up front then yeah. Stay away. So then I said that's, you know, they, they taught me where to stand and what to do, and I just kind of took off from there. And they're like, okay, thanks. And then I left. I, I felt good. And I remember coming out of that, and I think I said, if I get this thing, it's a miracle. So it's still up in the air as a miracle. So let's cross our fingers, pray give out good positive energy whatever else you can do please okay uh jacks will say bye